one thing is for sure, it's that you can never please everyone, right? And I know that very well because I'm one of those not very pleased with the new corrupted savior. Alright, what you see in the screen right now is me comparing the corrupted savior with the plasma cutter, right? And I'll tell you why I'm not very pleased. So, if you want just to see the build, just don't listen to me, just jump to the, straight to the point, and I think you're gonna like it. It's very strong. Alright, let's start to discuss about why I'm not very pleased. It's a personal opinion, because I do think that most of the people will love the new weapon, to put in one word. For me, it's very generic. You know, I've seen it already. That's why I'm comparing with Plasma Cutter. Uh, I don't mean uh, to be mean or complain, but it's just the same weapon basically, right? Just Plasma Cutter is a little bit better, as you can see huh, in the beginning. And the weapon Corrupted Savior comes with the Merciless mod, basically. It's just Merciless mod, but with extra steps and way, way heavier loading, right? So, I don't know how they can fix this. And I mean, sorry, not fix this because this is not the correct word. I don't know if they want to change it, of course. The patch is coming out right they can change a lot of things we never know but as the state it is right now i don't see myself using corrupted savior for the moment if i have plasma cutter see i'm sure in some situations it would be worth it right the mod ah where do i start like i said it's just like merciless mod and i think like I did with the, one of my previous videos, you can work pretty well just doing the merciless mod. And this one, the charging time of the mod, and the weapon becomes completely useless when you don't have mod charge. So it's kinda nah. You right now you don't want to use your mod, right? So. I won't lie, I was excited for Grot the Savior, but after trying it and doing what I can do, I just came to the conclusion that, well, it's just another, I don't know, a high DPS weapon. It's not a bad thing, I know a lot of people will like it because the normal Savior was special, let's say like that. <laughs> And that's why I like it, because it has a really, really high crit, uh, weak spot damage as well, like uh, Sagittarius. And also has a really nice mod, where you can clean uh, a lot of enemies with a bouncy, right? Amplitude. But this Corrupted Savior just remove all that and just gave you like a second Plasma Cutter. I don't know. I'm definitely trying other things right now. This is the first video I'm doing with a new patch. My first impressions. I need to try it better. I know that for the... What you say? The Nebula is a, uh, is, a, is a little bit funny how it's working right now. But that's it, guys. Let me know in the comments what you think. If you like it, the build. I'm telling you, it's, it was super easy to make it because it's plasma cutter. That's it. It's nothing new, this weapon. But anyway, I hope you guys like it. Thank you very much. Give it a like, subscribe, because I will cover more things. And Cyber out.